Good morning, friends. Stephen Benoon here with Israeli News Live, and uh, we lost our first recording of this. I'm really under a heavy attack this morning. Uh, Technology-wise, they are going after us like crazy, and I know why, because they know that we're on to them. They know that what we're revealing and what we're about to expose is going to be a major uh, hit on them once again. Uh, we did a video for Patreon. It is uploading as we speak right now. Uh, I am working this evening on the one for Planet X. Uh, we'll put that out by late tonight. It will be out for you as well on Patreon. But the other one that I did on Patreon is very important as well. You definitely are going to want to uh, view this information. Uh, I go into uh, this article right here. Charlie Ward presents the Pyramid Code, TLS. Uh, that's the light system. If you recall, we exposed this group a little while back over on our Patreon channel. I have made that video public as of, uh, well, no, that was actually made public eight months ago. So 60,000 views on it already. Maybe it wasn't on Patreon to start with. But anyway, uh, this group is becoming very, very serious group to deal with there. I, I have, uh, even over on our Patreon channel, I talk a little bit about uh, uh, this video here by Mr. Red Pill. And uh, Jason Shurka is involved, the very group that we exposed, with all these very big names. I can't even discuss it here on Israeli News Live with you. And so I have to kind of do, I'll do this over on iConnect. I'll be sharing that information with you very soon here. Uh, you'll get a 30 second clip here. You're definitely going to want to watch that video uh, to see what's going on. Right now, though, I wanted to talk to you a little bit about the, the uh, technology that is being used that they call the Havana Syndrome. Uh, and and I am not even sure who Jason A is. Uh, this was sent to me, uh, so I don't know anything about the individual or this channel here that shared it, but called the Havana Syndrome. And this is where they claim it's an unknown technology. Later in the video, they just, it is discussed that it, it is believed maybe a short burst of microwave technology, but these are pains that people are dealing with that are totally unexplained. And so I want you to hear a little clip of this right now, and then I'll explain to you what's really happening. First suffered from dizziness, cognitive difficulties, even memory loss. A cluster of unexplained Concussion-like symptoms first reported among American officials and covert personnel in Cuba back in 2016. He remembers the first time. And that night, all the dogs started kicking off in the neighborhood, barking, which is very unusual for them all to go in chorus. He'll go into how it was like having a pencil driven into your head, etc., things like that. Uh, if you'll notice, though, it was about the officials in 2016 in Cuba uh, in, in Havana. Uh, it was uh, of official, people of official capacity. Uh, they even had a journalist that went down there to try to cover the story. I forget exactly where that's at in here. Uh, and he, too, uh, ended up getting, getting attacked uh, on there. Let me see if I can find this here. Let me just see. As if I'd been seized by some invisible hand that I couldn't move. Sanjay spoke to the CIA's first investigator into the situation, Dr. Paul Andrews, who himself became a victim when he traveled to Havana to investigate. Okay, this sorry, is a preview. A CIA investigator. I think I went to bed probably around 11.30. I slept in my jeans and a t-shirt in case I had to evacuate quickly. And about 4.56, 4.57. And that did happen. Now, you know what's interesting, though, uh, of course, this is in 2016. We were also involved in covert operations going on as well uh, against Russian diplomats, and many of the Russian diplomats were dying, many of them dying very mysteriously of heart attacks, in fact. Um, I did this, and I actually, I think I, ju yeah, I just posted this video here a couple of seconds ago on our Stephen Benoon under my actual name there, under that channel there, this is where I was disclosing the fact that remote viewing was being used as a way for assassinating uh, targets. And we had become very, I shouldn't say we, the U.S. government had become very successful in doing so. Uh, I talk about that in this video here. Later, I did another video, which I think we made available on YouTube already. I don't think that's a Patreon video. This was a Patreon video that is now public. But... Uh, 
over half of those diplomats, and I think that was 2017, 2018, were targeted and killed uh, as a result of using remote viewing technology. So there are some really crazy things going on behind the scenes, but they're never going to disclose to you what is happening and why it's really happening. Later, this video here also goes to show that how that this happened in other part, 96 countries around the world this has happened in, and that could be done too. Some of it may not be the same technology, but it could be that they try to do that to divert attention for what they're really doing. Now, is it alien or is it uh, man-made technology? It is possible that it is uh, certainly reverse engineered alien technology or alien technology that's been given to these different governments that they use against one another. I don't really know the answer to that, but the point is it's very serious. And, uh, and of course, speaking of technology, that's what we're gonna be talking about. Uh, uh, well, actually we talked about that in the Patreon video that we just uploaded. So check that out over on Patreon. That technology that also talks about pyramid, or not, not pyramid technology, but uh, we talk about in there about the pyramid technology, electricity, some of the things that Mike from around the world just mentioned recently over on Paul's program, how you'd be able to charge your cell phone. Uh, without having to plug it into a wall. Uh, some of that technology is things that we have been disclosing for quite some time now, uh, how that actually works, including the underground trains, etc. So I think you'll find that interesting, that information on our Patreon channel. And again, like I said, I'll come back to the, uh, the other issue there. I'm under attack with our technology right now, so do pray for us there. And thank you for your support of the work we do here. Uh, and by the way, I haven't said anything in a long time about EMP Shield. And I still have not finished that film that we did. I started it, but I got to get that edited and get that out to you as quickly as I can there. Uh, I do encourage you to get an EMP shield. The way things are going right now, I would definitely have an EMP shield. In fact, I got to get another one myself here uh, before too long. Anyway, thank you for listening. And that, by the way, the coupon code will be in the description below, INL50. Definitely use that coupon code there. It'll save you $50. And the company does contribute to us. Uh, a little bit of money as well for for you know for promoting their product and I don't promote anything that I don't believe in uh, so quite frankly that that's an issue there and by the way I'll have to go into that on that x39 x49 patches as well like I said if I believe in it I'll promote it but if I don't I won't I think you can read between the lines on that one right Stephen Benoon with Israeli News Live thank you for your support israelinewslive.org is our website as you see there above your head and you can support us either by mail p.o box 156 sunbright tennessee or online by the way that face right there on the screen you'll find out later is with jason shirka it is a new world order agenda and now i know why we can't find to get justice the protection for this new world order system is phenomenal